There is science to everything in life, and I intend that you see what I'm saying. And so one of the strategies of me, Akil Mazan, is to draw analogies between the believer who fights the good fight and the athlete who accepts the challenges that help make hidden talents seen. I've always respected, appreciated, and admired a fighter spirit. Since today is Father's Day, it's fitting that I write this lyric. If the custom was reversed and the parents did, not name the child, but the child named the parent, my fathers would be the Arabic word mujahid, meaning one who fights the good fight. The life hidden with heavy blows as a son I would like to say as far as I could see, even when the doctor said he could die, he never gave up. He was always fighting, always striving. Like Job, it seems like life was always trying him with something. Whether or not it was struggling to make ends meet, he never gave up. I don't know if it was tempting, but seeing him in struggles that were never ending, it was not that I wanted to see my father giving up, but I asked him, Daddy, how come you're not quitting? And he said, son, you got nothing to look forward to if you give up. And little did he know, but what he did was, Give me some of the most inspiring words that he ever told me. When I feel like throwing you in the towel, his words console me. When the stressing swells and I'm catching hell, my reflections dwell on daddy's example whose lessons tell. Me remember 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 11 and 12. These are some of the Bible verses me and you should read. He's the fighter of the good fight, Arabic mujahid. My father's like the ground when you fall, always there. Like a law for believers who know there's always prayer. If not in person on the phone, when I call, he shared inspiration to help me not to fall in despair. Never ever been a doubt. Daddy always cared, always answered the bell. I seen him brawl in bed. The hard knocks of life, he is not a towel thrower. He would man up and stand up like Rocky Balboa. They say, they say the greatness of one's character isn't solely measured by the accomplishment of victory, but the quality of their efforts and the manner of their striving. And I've always believed, though I didn't have all I wanted, I felt I had all my needs supplied by mommy and daddy. I love you for who you are, what you've done and had the intention to do. And because in my heart, I believe the source of your words and deeds is love, which is the greatest motivating force. Daddy says, son, you got nothing to look forward to if you give up. And little did he know, but what he did was give me some of the most inspiring words that he ever told me. When I feel like throwing in the towel, his words console me. When the stress and swells and I'm catching hell, my reflections dwell on daddy's example whose lessons tell. We remember 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 11 and 12. These are some of the Bible verses, me and you should read. He's the fighter of the good fight, Arabic mujahid. Like God for believers in prayer, daddy's always been there. Just like when we need to breathe, it's always been air. He's a great giver of gifts. My father's so considerate, knowledgeable, funny, and very articulate, but well-spoken. My love, I hope you see with clarity, feel sincerity. He's somewhat responsible for my familiarity with playing on words. He had a way with the words, like, if I say, what's up, <laughs> daddy might say the ceiling. Or he say, with his fingers, if I ask how he's feeling. And my father has a great appreciation of her. A lot of different kinds of music. Also, he and my mother stayed together in marriage for 20-some years, not necessarily because of each other, but I believe mostly out of love for me and my younger brother, a love so unselfish, and so I relish this opportunity to publicly tell this. I know love because daddy showed love. I know love because daddy showed love. I know love because daddy showed love. I know love because mommy and daddy showed love. My father's like the ground when you fall, always there. Like God for believers who know there's always prayer. If not in person on the phone, when I call, he shared. Inspiration to help me not to fall in despair. Never ever been in doubt. Daddy always cared, always answered the bell. I seen him brawl in bed. The hard knocks of life, he is not a towel thrower. He would man up and stand up like Rocky Balboa. I love you, Daddy.